Welcome back to The Witness, and shall we solve some more puzzles on this very peculiar island in what could be one of a, either the final episode or the penultimate final episode. It's crazy to think how far we've come. Okay, it, uh, it's been a couple of days, but I, I did check what we were doing on this one. We're starting it, I believe this is where we wanted it to start, and we want to make it rotate clockwise as many times as possible, right? So we want to have it on, wait, one, two, purple and red. And I remember, uh, it's the direction you draw these things, which, um, decide which direction it goes in. So that's going to make it go anti-clockwise. Um, how can we p put this in such that it goes clockwise? Am I stupid? Excuse me. Excuse me. <laughs> my, my mouse sensitivity. Yeah, it's crazy. Uh, is this clockwise? This does look clockwise. It's, um... Pretty crazy how much we've done of this game. And we're nearing the end. I don't know quite which way we need to go for us to... Oh, it looks like it's this way. No? Uh, I don't know where this bar is. Oh, here it is. There we go. It's crazy how far we come. Um, we've only got a few things left. We got. Excuse me. I'm trying to. I'm trying to move on it. What? <sighs> Sometimes. This anchor just weighs me down. I can't believe that did not work out for us. Oh, this is gonna take forever if we do it this way around. Hold on. Um. <laughs> Why can I not remember how to do any of these puzzles? Oh, I can use this time to talk. Um, yeah, we don't have much left to do. We're missing, like, I believe six normal puzzles, which as brought up by someone in the comments, um, they're probably not actually all triangle puzzles. As I initially thought they were, because, I don't know, I, I just initially assumed that they were all triangle puzzles I missed, and I, I've been recommending, I believe it was... John? Who said so that they're probably in the caves where, if there's anything I missed, if there's any of these puzzles I missed, because um, it's quite easy to miss ones there, so fair enough. Um, I'm trying to internally decide whether um, how I'm going to approach these last few puzzles, because the, the environmental puzzles I'm missing, I know for sure they're in the theatre. Um, I haven't watched the videos, I'm not sure if- I don't really want to watch them on camera. Because <laughs> that's probably incredibly long. And also, like, finding ver environmental- oh my god, there we go. Puzzles in it sounds a bit of a nuisance rather than a fulfilling. Because I know that some of them- <laughs> one of them, especially about you, that's the last one. Uh, hold on, we should probably get off. <laughs> and figure out where we're going. Mm. Well, I guess we'll take the boat somewhere. <laughs> to the mountain. Maybe we could take it to the town. Because... Actually, I think we have one more environmental puzzle in this area, right? Hold on. Oh, we have to go back to the mountain. How do we get back to the mountain? Over here? Probably. This might, might be the fastest way. So anyway, yeah. Um, the environmental puzzles I'm missing... Oh, actually, we, st we still got this cloud one, which I don't have to figure out, but I don't know. I'll probably look at the hint guide for that one um, to get me a hint. The ones I know we're missing are in the theatre, which I'll probably look up. And um, there's triangle puzzles I'm missing, which I'll probably also just look up a guide for, <laughs> to be honest. I like, it's coming to the, the ages, we know the witness is, is basically at the end, we, we've had a fun journey. And now, we, I'm sort of just going through the motions for completions for the sake of completion, to be honest. Well, I mean, we'll see how much we've got left. Like, we have... Wait, 5, 4, and 7. I think it was 5, 2, 3, so yeah, we're missing 6. Um... Yeah, and... I'm not sure if there's a way to find the triangle puzzles. Like, if there's... If there, if there is hints, that'd be great, but... Unfortunately, I don't know if there are. <laughs> and plus, I'm not very good at exploring, so it's sort of like... 
I'm, I'm doing this obviously for completion also because I think that looking up for looking looking them up in a guide would be better because I don't think a video is going to be very entertaining on me just walking around aimlessly not being able to find things like so environmental puzzles I think it was good using the wiki because at least I had a general idea of where they were so it made it a lot easier and it made it perhaps a lot more <laughs> at least it made it probably more engaging for you and it was definitely much more engaging for me because you know I didn't feel just aimlessly wandering about which is not you know as, as again with the exploration thing uh, I can't actually remember where the mountain one is <laughs> Um, I don't even remember how we get to the mountain. Oh, we can, we can do it from here, right? If we go over back. It's, I don't know, my my memory's all a bit hazy now. With how we move around here. Um, so, I, I do want to get to 100% because I'm like, I'm, I'm so close. Like, why not, basically, at this point? Just do it. Um, but I am concerned, but I don't know what puzzle I'm missing. Actually, I had to think, I had to think about the fact when, um, it was brought up that it was probably missing in the caves. I think I missed one of the elevator puzzles. Because there's an elevator that brings you back at the beginning. And I think... There's like... Multiple. Um, not multiple. But there was one in the elevator. There was one at the bottom elevator and one at the top. I don't think I did the one at the top. So I had to look at that. I'm also missing one environmental puzzle here. I don't know where it is. So let's see. Let's see where the wiki says it is. So we'll concentrate on finding this first. Colour Swamp. Let's go back to the Colour Swamp then. Um, and it's in this direction, which is interesting. So it's in the early part of the Colour Swamp. Um, so that, that's just something to keep in mind, I suppose. <clears throat> Actually, we can do it right now. Like, I think it was this. I don't think I sold this puzzle. Let's see if it... Yeah, okay, that was, a, that was one of them I... I'm missing. Um, we're missing a f five more, right? Where am I? Here's a colour swamp. And I, I have a pretty good feeling those are probably all triangle puzzles. Um, so that's not too bad because at least that's like, you can find a guide about it. A guide showing you where they are. Oh, is that right? Wait, hold on. Which two of the one we need? I don't. I don't remember which corner it is. Is it these two? It might be. It might be these two. There we go. So yes. Um. That's basically all I had to say about that. Uh, the cutter swamp. So it's somewhere in the front part of the cutter swamp. So I guess we shouldn't have left that area. It's somewhere over here, then. Because this is a front part of a colour swamp. Maybe it's up here somewhere? Could it be back here? Still in this... Could be in this general direction, I don't know. I don't really need... I don't really know what I'm looking for. Hmm... <laughs> yeah, I'm not going to find all the audio logs. I've, I've decided. Because... That's... <laughs> I can't be bothered, to be honest. That's so much searching. I, I, I think it's basically the witness... What I'm trying to express is the witness has come to its natural end, I think. In fact, it, it sort of came to its natural end, you know, after I found the secret ending. And I was considering stopping it there, but I was like, you know, let's give these environmental puzzles a shot. And I, some of them are really fun, but some of them I'm also like, yeah, I can tell that this is not the gameplay for me. <laughs> I'm very much, give me a puzzle in front of me, I'll solve the puzzle. That's... What keeps me engaged, but you know, I've talked about that on Nauseam. You don't need him, don't need to hear me about talk about that again. We've done this one, right? I'm pretty sure we've done this one. Why is this not right? Excuse me, excuse me. Oh, it's because it's too close, right? It needs to be further away. I'm pretty, pretty sure we've done that one. So, yeah, um, so this might be the last one, depending if we can get it all done. If it's not, I know there's one that takes one hour. I guess we should get this turning around. Um, one hour to do, which I don't know. Maybe I'll do it, but that sort of feels like I'm just doing it out of spite to finish it rather than because I particularly want to. But um, that one will, I don't know. I don't know how I'm going to do that. May <laughs> like maybe I could record it and speed it up a huge amount and put it in the corner of the screen. Or maybe you could just, you know, I'll do it off camera afterwards. <laughs> Just after the final episode, and it would just be like, you, you'll you just have to trust me that I did it. 
I think that's probably the best way to do it. And even if I don't do it, oh well. <laughs> Who can blame me? I'm not going to sit here for an hour. <laughs> it's a very much sort of... um. I feel like it's better to sort of play with the people who want to do 100% completion, right? Being like, you're so... Sort of like a call out, being like, this is how badly you want 100% completion, alright? Then sit here and wait for an hour for it. And you know, maybe... You know, maybe when I was younger, I'd be about that. I'm not now, to be honest. I'm like, <laughs> nah, I'm alright. <laughs> so, like, I don't even want to wait like 30 seconds for some of these environmental puzzles to line up. <laughs> I mean, like, I could wait for an hour, or I could do something else, is basically how I'm trying to frame it. Um, I don't know where on earth this puzzle is, to be honest. I, I can't even see anything that it would possibly be, so... Let's have a glance at the guide. Um, I don't know where it is. Here it is, number two. Oh, it's in the caves, it looks like. It's very much in the caves. So yeah, um... That's okay. You know? Oh! Sorry, my phone going crazy. Let me just unplug it. I've I've had a won wonderful time with Witness. It is definitely one of my favourite puzzle games. Its use of rules and things that are so clever. I love, you know, it's just great. <laughs> I love figuring out the rules of these puzzles. All these little like um aha moments it gives you as you finally crack something. Any game which makes you feel really stupid. Any puzzle game which makes you feel stupid. Stupid. It's great in my book. So, but it's uh, basically, you know, there's always a goodbye. Sometimes it's time to say goodbye. So it kind of looked like it was. Oh, here it is. Over here somewhere. I don't know where we need to stand for that. Over here, maybe. Hmm. Maybe we stand over there by the pillar and look up at it. Yeah, there we go. Almost, almost, hold on, hold on. Perfect. And with that, I believe we're done with a mountain pillar. In fact, we could just load a game and see. Yep, number five. So all we've got to left to do is go back to the town, which I believe we can get to from the caves. I don't remember how, but okay, that's really the challenge. That's not it. Um, somewhere in the caves we can do it and then I guess we'll just do these triangle puzzles in whatever episode that ends up being um, oh God, it's been so long that I can't remember how to do any of these puzzles anymore oh we had to do it the other way of course like <laughs> it's been so long since I had to do any of these rules of these puzzles it's, been, it's how long we've been searching for environmental puzzles and I'm glad we've seen quite a lot of this to the end. Otherwise, we would have missed out on some really cool environmental puzzles, which I, you know, that's a good thing I'm doing this YouTube channel. I definitely wouldn't have done any of the environmental puzzles had I not been, you know, recording and people were being like, oh, it's cool, you know? I'd be like, alright, I'll give it a shot. And, you know, I'm glad I gave it a shot. It is cool. I mean, it's not all for me. Uh, I don't remember where on earth the tunnel is. <laughs> Maybe there isn't a tunnel to a fitter. I could have sworn there is a tunnel to a fitter somewhere. I remember doing puzzles for it. Maybe it's this way. Just there's, there's somewhere that leads, leads into the town. No, it's not this way. This is the challenge. Is it over here? No, that's where we came from. Is it up here? Bear with me. Yeah, do, do I think I've missed five triangular puzzles? I think that's very plausible that I've missed five triangle puzzles. We've already done my audio log, I think. Or maybe we didn't, I don't know. <laughs> um. Wow, I, I do not remember where this shortcut is. I also want to look at the lake again, because it's been a while. Why I keep coming up here? Okay, you know what? Never mind. We'll, we'll just go the regular way. <laughs> Back to the town. We'll just walk there, you know? And maybe we can figure out what we're doing with that cloud thing. That one rain... That 
stormy cloud. Oh, is it this way? Was it this one? No, this is where we came from. No, this is where we came from. Maybe it's that one. No, this is where we came from. <laughs> Wait, I don't remember anymore. I'm confused. I'm sorry. Okay, no, this is the swamp. Which is not too far from the town. So yeah, we can see the start of that cloud puzzle. We definitely know it is the correct one because we can just start drawing it in. It's just, um... We can't really do anything to it. How do we interact with this cloud? I could have sworn this was definitely it. Yeah, there we go. Because this is a different colour. How do we make a cloud a different colour? Where's the town? Anyway, I forgot. Oh, I thought my phone started ringing. <laughs> is it? Oh, it is my phone. Hold on. It was a spam caller. <laughs> I thought it wasn't my phone because my phone's kind of old. It didn't display anything on its screen, but I heard it vibrating. And I was like, hmm. Where, where is the town? I actually can't remember anything. My, my brain scrambled. Oh, you know, we can look up a lake as well. We see things in all its glory. Mm. And we know there's definitely things... You can track everything on the lake. Um, apparently it's also more useful. I don't remember why. It's, <laughs> it's been a while since we had conversations about the lake, you know. Why is our last mountain, which we haven't... ...made... ...rise up? Hmm. Hmm. Hold on a second. So, I, I just had a thought. I was trying to think back to the conversations. I remember someone trying to imply to me that this was, you know, similar to the mountain statue. This is like where the mountain obelisk is, isn't it? If this was like in relation to that, right? Do the lasers add up? So this is... That must be the mountain laser. Wait. So is this a jungle laser? That's the... That's that laser? No, but that's the town obelisk, the one we haven't done, isn't it? Wait, what obelisk is this? Maybe, wait, maybe this isn't the map, hold on. Uh, for a second I was going to be like, maybe this is a map of everything. Wait, maybe it is. It's a bit, because the shipwreck's over there, isn't it? This is the keep. That's a keep laser. Oh, no, that's a keep laser, that's a diff- wait, this is a swamp laser? Oh, that's a swamp laser. Because this is like part of a, a shipwreck, isn't it? I remember I remember someone commented it, it was like <laughs> there was something about the shipwreck and it being like it would make sense of where it is on the lake. So that's paraphrasing. And I remember reading that comment and being like, I don't know what that means, but okay. Oh my god, is this like the hint that people are trying trying to get me to understand this entire time? Is that the fact that this is actually a map of the entire place? I think it does make sense. Because that's a desert obelisk. No, no, that's a desert obelisk. Oh, and that's a desert laser, right? And that's, like, the Symmetry Island one? I don't know what laser this, the obelisk this is. One of the, the earlier ones, probably. So, 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 actually doing that, we probably could find the triangle panels. I don't know if I ever figured out what the triangle panels, like, what you used on the map. Sorry, on the... <laughs> I called this map now, on the lake to track which ones you, how many you've done. I remember I think I said these are audio logs, right? The lights are lasers. Well, we know the shipwreck has a triangle puzzle. So maybe let's just look for something here, which seems indicative. I don't think it's this, because there's, I've only seen like four of those. Oh, you know what? This is probably um the, the, the hex gun, the, the theatre puzzle. Puzzle. There's like nothing else here. There was definitely an audio log, there's a theatre puzzle. And there was definitely a triangle panel panel. Is it this tiny triangle? It is a triangle, to be fair. It is a triangle. Okay, well, I don't know. I, I can't see any other triangles. Where where else was there a triangle panel? There's one of the mountain, right? Do we see any more triangles there? I can't see anything. <laughs> Hold on, we need to cross the bridge. 
This has not become a hunting episode for environmental puzzles. This has now become a lake discovery episode. <laughs> it's, it's, it's all coming together now. It's all coming together. This is why the lake is so useful. I was like, it can't be that useful if it distracts things, right? <laughs> you can already do that. Yeah, look, hold on. There are two triangles there. Were there two triangle panels in the mountain? I actually can't remember. There's definitely one on the elevator on the way down. There must have been two. Maybe this one's outside the mountain. Notice that this is still flickering, so that's a bit interesting. Maybe that means... Maybe that stops flickering once you 100% of the game. And there's another triangle orange here. So where's this? I don't know. I need... A okay, so... Why don't we count how many orange ones we're missing so we can actually see if it's all triangle panels we're missing. So that's one. Oh, we're going to have to be really observant. They're really hard to spot. And what if it's in the middle there? I'm not going to see it. Okay, two. There's another one here. Let's be careful. So this is a town. So this is not too far from a town. Uh, I think this is a town obelisk, right? The one which is... I don't even know where it is anymore. So that's two. Or was it three? I immediately lost count. I think it was two. <laughs> so this is the starting area, right? There's a triangle panel not too far from the starting area, I think. Apparently there's a load of audio logs which I missed, which, you know, makes sense. Didn't, didn't really know what I was looking for. Is there a bunker near there? Oh, this must... No. Was there a bunker? Yeah, there was. There was a bunker near the starting area. Okay, this is all adding up. This is all adding up. Oh, yeah, it's all coming together. Okay, three. There's one I missed here, which is... I don't know where this is. Very off to the corner somewhere. <laughs> I don't know what this is either. What's over there? Oh, is it, this is ruins? Right, yeah, this must be ruins. That's a bunker. Another bunker over there. Mm, I can't see anything over there. So that's three, I believe, we've counted so far. Let's go across a bridge, see what else we can find. Hmm... It's amazing how many details there are in this game, huh? <laughs> I'm like, how many episodes in? And I'm still discovering things. With, to be fair, lots of prompting from a community. Um, if I didn't have any people commenting, I would literally have never looked up as like four. It seems very plausible it's all triangle puzzle panels I missed then. Wait, was that only four? Hmm. What heck's over here? Was the audio logo way over here? Ah, oh, where did I start counting though? That's a, that's a big question. Is that one over there? I can't tell. From this far out. I think I was only four. Oh, that's going to be a problem. Which triangle panel did I miss then? So, oh, sorry, no, which regular puzzle panel did I miss then? Hmm. Oh, I don't know, because I don't even know what these ones are. Unless I miscounted. I'm pretty sure that was four, though. Wait, is that one? No, this is the one I started on, isn't it? I don't remember. Ah. There's one, two. There's one there at three, and there's one there at four. I think that's only four. There's, there's 12 in total, right? We should count how many um, ones we have done then, as well. So that's one. It's two. It's a really hard spot, to be honest. Three. Probably because I'm running. Um. Um. Four. Oh 
wonder how someone discovered this on my own. <laughs> that seems like a very... <laughs> or maybe it's just me. Maybe I'm not inquisitive enough that I wouldn't come with these sort of leaps to um try and piece things together. Oh, I don't think I quite counted that one. Did I? I just can't remember. This must be infuriating if you're watching <laughs> the recording of this because <laughs> I'm not keeping track very well in my head. So we know we've got one there. Five. Whatever it is. There. Six. Got the two there, seven, eight. Seven, eight, hold on, yeah, seven, eight. Oh no. We're only missing four. Oh no. Where's the one we're missing? Oh my god. We're missing one solo panel somewhere in this game. If that isn't the saddest thing. <sighs> Oh well. <laughs> no time to be sad. Let's try and figure out what we're doing in the... Where, where's the town obelisk again? Hmm. This... Bear with me. What? You know... <laughs> I wonder if the game was designed that way such you walk into town you immediately see that laser. <laughs> I was going to be like, let's try and figure out this um, cloud puzzle. And then I saw this and I was like, that's something which can reach into the sky. You know, I did not think it would work. I also do not know why that does that. Why, why would a laser turn? You know, maybe I'm overthinking it, obviously. This is video game logic, you know. That seems very unclear to me, though. <laughs> I don't know how you're meant to get that. Naturally. That just seems crazy to me. <laughs> like, what? And I can't even get it aligned anymore. There we go. Oh my god, I can't believe we are, we are missing one panel somewhere. Well, actually, you know what it could be? I could have just got it entirely wrong, to be fair. <laughs> my understanding of Lake, but I'm pretty sure that's correct. Oh yeah, that's where the town obelisk is, down there. I can't believe it's been a map this entire time. Let's have it pointing back in the mountain. I don't know if it does anything, but... Oh my god. What potential panel could I have even missed? Somewhere in the caves. It's possible, but through my quick glancing around, it doesn't... I didn't see a panel I was missing. Unless there's a way in the game to tell you which... Where your panels you're potentially missing are. It seems like we might be a little bit stuck here. We could have... Maybe we haven't called a boat in every single... Stop. See, these I'm pretty sure are all theatre puzzles. And it's just the last thing we need to do. You know what? I think that's something I'll do off camera. I'm going to call the, the boat at every single possible stop. And then I'll tell you um, if it's one of them that I'm missing. But anyway, for now, let's round off this episode here. Well, you know, surprising, even though we didn't do that much, I felt like I learned a lot from this episode, to be honest. I feel like, you know, a lot of the game has just been, like, enlightened for me <laughs> from understanding the lake now. But anyway, if you have been watching, thank you very much for been the witness. And I've been Dear Darling. Any likes, comments, and subscriptions are greatly appreciated. If you want to join me, Dear, Dear, Dear Darling, just go down in the description below so you can tell me how bad I am at the witness. I'm joking, by the way. This self-deprecating humour. <laughs> I hope we can see each other again. But for now, it's our farewell. So until next time, bye-bye for now.